Hey guys, so we looked at the oxidation of primary and secondary alcohols in the presence of our acidified dichromate solution. Um, so as there's an oxidation reaction happening to the alcohols, there is an accompanying reduction reaction that happens to the dichromate ions, and this is very important for you guys to know um, very likely that this reaction and the um, physical observations that go along with it are likely to pop up in an exam question. Um, so on your slides you'd notice it says primary and secondary alcohols reduce orange dichromate ions to green chromium 3 ions in solution. Okay so we need to look at what that might look like. Okay so we've got chromate, dichromate, right and these are orange in color, and I've used a green texture, which is a bit silly. Orange. This is red. Okay. Now, in a reduction reaction, okay, we're reducing an ion. Well, here we've got reduction of an anion to a cation. Right. The reduction is chromium three ions, which is three plus. Okay, so this is the overall, well, this is the half reduction reaction, um, orange, and then the color of your solution actually changes to green. So this is a handy um, physical observation that can be used to identify um, the presence of primary and secondary alcohols, and you can distinguish between primary and secondary and tertiary alcohols because like I said tertiary alcohols um, are not oxidized by dichromate therefore the dichromate is not reduced you should have no color change um, so this reaction is not quite complete so I'll just draw the complete reaction underneath looking at dichromate um, now it's acidified so we've got some hydrogen ions um, our products are chromium-3 and water okay so all we need to do is balance this equation and balance the charge all right we've got two chromiums on the left hand side so we need to have two chromiums on the right hand side we've got seven oxygens on the left so we need seven oxygens on the right seven H2O now we've got fourteen hydrogens here and only one here so we need to chuck a fourteen in here okay so all our atoms are balanced we just need to balance the charge on the right hand side we've got two three plus that's six plus and on the left hand side we've got fourteen plus and uh, 2 minus 14 plus and 2 minus gives you a total of 12 plus so we actually need to add 6 electrons here for our balanced charge ok so we've got chromate or dichromate Cr2O7 2 minus plus 14 hydrogen ions and 6 electrons it gives you 2 uh, chromium 3 plus ions and 7 water molecules ok this is a reduction half equation for acidified dichromate solution and it's just very important for you to be able to note that the solution starts with really like an orange color and then once the oxidation of uh, the alcohol has, is complete there will be a reduction of the dichromate and the solution should change to a green color. Okay.